She'll take on seven other foes. They're into the stretch. Gathering speed approaching the start. Off and trotting goes the group of eight. And it was a good beginning outside. Felicity Shagwell trots out quickest of the bunch for Filion. Down the center, plunge blue chip. Hey, Libby away cleanly. In at the rail. She comes away third. Off stride, Atlanta. Atlanta was just ducking in behind horses, and she's on the run in that first turn. So the landscape of the Armbrough flight has changed drastically, hasn't it? Into the first turn they go. Felicity Shagwell overtaken now by plunge blue chip. Hey, Libby is right there with them third off a Quarter of 27 and 3, and here she comes to the outside as Henry hits the go button. Into the back stretch, plunge blue chip to the front from McClure, under attack from Hay Levy, who's parked and pressing now. Back into third is Felicity Shagwell, five back to left, Cata from in fourth. Inside fifth, only take cash. Racing up six, superlative. Then seventh, pure chance. And Atlanta, she's got a tall mountain to climb. Back there, eighth, but underway for Jingra. Half and 55 and two. Second panel trotted 27, four fifths. Hay Libby into the final turn. Leads it by two lengths here for Henry. Back into second plunge, blue chip. Felicity Shagwell third, the rail fourth, left Cata. Underway outside fifth, only take cash. Atlanta sixth, seventh inside superlative. And overland from an eighth is pure chance. Trotting mares two, three quarters. Chasing after Hay Libby. Length and a half the best over plunge, blue chip second. Felicity Shagwell third. The outside fourth is only take cash. Three quarters in 123. Three fifths into the stretch they come. Hay Libby. Kicks it into another gear now for Henry. Widening out her advantage to four. Back into second is Plunge Blue Chip. Dropped inside Felicity Shagwell. Eighth of a mile to go. Still there with the lead is Hay Livy. Felicity Shagwell between. Outside Plunge Blue Chip. Hay Livy on top by two lengths in deep stretch. And it's Hay Livy with the arm roll flight stake score. Second best was Felicity Shagwell. Third Plunge Blue Chip. Superlative fourth in 151 and two. Hey, Livy, with the uh, mild upset tonight in the Armbrough Flight Final in 151 and 2. Trevor, uh, maybe talk about the trip in the early stages. You protected position, and did you have any inkling that Atlanta had gone off stride behind you? No, I had no idea that she had run. You know, I, I might have changed things, but uh, I don't know. I didn't know she run. Talk about the approach coming into the race. Um, you had her on a regular rotation, then... Uh, Gave her a little bit of time off, a couple of qualifiers, and one start before this. Was that all by design? Yeah, Jeff, he looked after that. He, uh, We could have went to the Earl Row in Georgian last week, but I wouldn't have been able there to drive her. And it might have changed her routine, so we opted just to qualify her again and go off that. She qualifies good. You can go whatever you want. So These wins are special any time but how special is it when you own part of the horse oh for sure like it, i got this horse part of it given to me because i got along with her you know and she was so hard at the start and she still is hard to drive but uh, you know she's a fast mare and you appreciate it when she wins and finally just a, a quick thought on denali sealster in the na cup uh, he'll be an outsider any shot at getting some money with the right kind of trip? If they race hard up front and uh, things work out, I might be able to grab a five. I'd be happy with fifth. I'm sure Doc would too, but you know, everything's got to work out. We're outsiders and fifth case, fifth, fifth place is best case scenario, I think. Congratulations, good luck the rest of the way. That's Trevor Henry, co-owner and driver of Hay Livy, and she is the 2020 Armbro Flight Champion.